Julian, a lot of our viewers, will, well, all of our viewers will know the Dante name and will have used Dante in the last uh, five years or so. Um, what's relatively new in the last kind of two years or so is Dante V. Um, I wonder if you could tell us about developments over that time and kind of what's new right now in the world of Dante V. Certainly. Uh, I think the most important thing is just the, 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 the constant growth in that platform. So we're seeing a substantial number of new partners come on board. We're up to 30 manufacturers that have announced the adoption of Dante AV. I've, that's another few in the background that haven't yet announced it. We've got um, products, new products on display in the Dante AV Ultra and the Dante AVH range. So I think we're seeing the constant growth and evolution of that platform. Sure. And are there any uh, developments in the, I don't know what to call it, traditional Dante or no, normal Dante? Uh, um, the normal are, Dante that, that, are, that you... That the system integrators should really know about absolutely, recently. Absolutely. I, I mean, it's, as you said, even with Dante, it's an ever-evolving platform, isn't it? People yeah. are joining all the time. Yeah. Well, I think one of the main pillars that we're, we've been focusing on, uh, and which you can see here, is the, 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 the management element to it. As you start getting beyond audio and you start also deploying video, managing that estate is going to become ever more critical. So not only does Dante Domain Manager also manage those video endpoints, but Dante Domain Manager also provides access to an API allowing you to make easy control surfaces for your customers to use. Everyone in the pro AV world will be familiar with Dante Controller. Yeah. Do you want to really leave Dante Controller in the hands of a user? <laughs> You, oh, you yeah. understand. Yes, yes. So being able to reduce that vast range of control options down to a two, three button yes. choice yeah, yeah. is is a game changer for uh, a lot of integrators, a lot of users. And it's the single most requested feature since I joined in the company. <laughs> I think it's, for me, it's a close tie between that and video. Yeah, so yeah. we did video yeah, yeah, and now yeah. we're addressing the other question, which is having that API. It's free of charge for any customers that have got Dante Domain Manager. Um, and that just makes it incredibly simple. And if you come down to the stand and I'll show you after this, this yeah, yeah. discussion, you'll see us push a button and you'll see those video endpoints swap over like that. Push another button and you'll see those audio endpoints change over as well. So that is making it that much easier to, 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 to control but reduce the risk of people making mistakes inside your Dante network. Fantastic. Um, Julian, lovely to talk to you. It's great to hear that the, the platform it, that is so established is kind of constantly evolving as well to keep oh, up we, kind we, of changing you know, needs. We, we are conquering multiple lands. So we've moved into the video world, so we're going to do our best there, but we're also expanding into the cloud as well. So you're going to see a lot of a lot of new things coming out there in here and in the forthcoming shows as well. Brilliant. And many thanks for your time. Thanks My for pleasure. Talking. Thank you. Thank you.